What will you do, curious George? It's a bright, sunny morning, and curious George wants his friend, the man with the yellow hat, to read him a story. But the man is rushing out the door. He tells George to meet him downtown at noon by the big clock for a surprise. I know you're a curious little monkey, but don't be late, he says with a smile. And try not to get into any messes. George has some time before he needs to meet his friend. There are so many things he could choose to do. What should George do first? George works on a puzzle, or George paints a picture. George takes a big bite of a banana, then he puts on a smock, and paints and paints and paints. George paints a colorful picture. He also makes a huge mess. He can't go out covered in big blobs of paint. George has only one choice, and it involves a lot of bubbles. Afterward. He'll be ready to go downtown. George takes a bath. His friend told him to stay clean, but it's too easy for a curious little monkey to get messy. That's okay. George hops in the tub and takes a nice warm bubble bath. Scrub a dub dub. The bath will make George squeaky clean and ready for a fresh start. Then he can set off downtown to meet the man with the yellow hat. How should George get there? George takes the bus, or George rides his bike. George jumps on the bus and heads downtown. There is so much to see. The man with the yellow hat warned George not to be late, but this curious little monkey isn't worried. There's still plenty of time to get to the big clock. What should George do first? George gets off the bus and visits the animal shelter, or George gets off the bus and visits the music store. At the shelter, the animals are happy to see their curious friend, and George is happy to see them. A kitten purrs, a puppy wags its tail, and a parrot calls out, "Hello!" The animal shelter is so much fun, but there is much more to see downtown before George needs to be at the big clock. Where should he go next, George? Visits the music store, or George visits the balloon seller. George meets a nice lady who gives him a big bunch of balloons. George likes balloons, and he is happy to have so many. But the balloons are too strong for a little monkey. George floats up, up, up in the air. How will he get back down to the ground? George grabs onto the branch of a tall tree, or George drops into a swimming pool. George lets go of the balloons and drops into the swimming pool, with a mighty splash. There's a monkey in the pool, and the kids are thrilled. After floating for a while, George dries off with a fluffy towel. George spotted two things while he was up in the air that he'd like to check out. Which one will he do first? George will visit the fire station. George will join in a soccer game. At the station, George sees his firefighter friends. They dress him up in a coat and a hat. He slides down the pole. Wee! 
George is having lots of fun, and he still has his surprise to look forward to. What should he do next? George doesn't want to be late. He heads straight to the big clock, or there's still time. George decides to join a soccer game. At last, George arrives at the meeting place. The big clock, tick tock. Will the man with the yellow hat get there soon? What will the surprise be? Despite all of his adventures, George is still a bit early. This little monkey has a big decision to make. George waits here for his friend. Or there's still a little time. Flying a kite would be nice. A nice girl lets George take a turn flying her kite. George grabs the string and runs. The kite goes up, but George falls down right in a big puddle. Splat! Yuck! Now George is covered with gloppy mud. He can't meet the man with the yellow hat like this. Fortunately, there is still time to get cleaned up. George goes home to take a bath. His friend told him to stay clean, but it's too easy for a curious little monkey to get messy. That's okay. George hops in the tub and takes a nice warm bubble bath. Scrub a dub dub. The bath will make George squeaky clean and ready for a fresh start. Then he can set off downtown to meet the man with the yellow hat. How should George get there? George takes the bus. Or George rides his bike.